What? Where's the scoop? Uh, it should just be next to the coffee pot. Ah. We're making coffee. Okay. At five o'clock in the evening. Cause we just spent all day driving to uh, our place where we get pallets, where we bought two more pallets. And uh, we spent a little over a thousand dollars, 1,015. 1,016 maybe on two uh, two pallets, Target Returns, the classic Target Returns. These are a mix of uh, returns and shelf pulls and overstock and all around goodness. The quality on these have been fantastic every time we've gotten them. We spent another $65 on a trailer and uh, another $100, let's say, on gas and uh, meals that we probably wouldn't have bought otherwise. So, you know, we're looking all in around $1,200, let's say, a little, a little less than that. We're gonna do some unboxing today. Thanks for watching. Before uh, I get too far into this, I wanna give some shout outs to uh, my buddy Edward Turner and uh, KPM Flips, and I will put both their channels in the description down below for this. I, they've both shouted me out in some of their videos, and I really appreciate that. And I uh, just wanna return the love, guys, so thanks so much. Well, I guess we'll just dive right in. Oh, my wife wants me to tell you, to inform you, that I don't have a mullet. I just haven't cut my hair in a year because of the pandemic. And until I have to return to the office, which has now been pushed back into July, uh, at least, uh, I have decided I will not cut my hair. So it is just swept back and growing lusciously and long. And I am going bald a little bit, so I am definitely using this as a final excuse to grow my hair out. And that's what I'm doing. Inquiry minds just want to know <laughs> what's going on with the hair. What's going on with my mullet? Yeah. <laughs> right. So I'll split this up into however many videos I need to. I like my videos to be around 20 to 30 minutes. So we will start diving in. I'm gonna go off first though. There are a couple large, t big ticket items on this that I will not be putting in the video because I just don't wanna move them. Uh, actually this one right here, maybe you can kind of see it. This is a large desk and I'll put a picture, like a stock image of it uh, up to the side. I've also got a dresser over there, same thing. Both of these boxes have some uh, pretty gnarly box damage. So I'll be checking those just to make sure everything's uh, Copacetic. And finally, we've got a whole dining room set. Uh, table, chairs, it's got a leaf in it, and it like folds in on itself. Three. It's a three piece set. Three piece set, two chairs, wow. yeah. and uh, a leaf, uh, an expandable table with a leaf. So, I probably won't show any of those. Oh, I also have um, two of those cube organizers that I get and I love because they sell so quickly. We've got a three tiered one, so that's six bays, and then a four, uh, two tiered one with four bays. So I probably won't show those either, just because they're so heavy. And hopefully I've shown you all images and maybe how much they cost as I'm doing this. Uh, and maybe I was lazy and you're not seeing any of that. I don't know, because current JD doesn't know how future JD is going to feel when he's editing this video. So let's get into these and I don't have my knife. So I'll be right back with a knife so I can open some boxes. And I have a knife. All right. Uh, there was a decent amount of stuff of case packed items on this palette. So I'm really curious to find out what those are. It's not a ton, it's not the majority of the palette, but just a few items. And I have no idea what they are. I know that this is one of one, and I have two boxes of this. So let's find out what this is. Those, uh, this reminds me of like those Jonathan Y lamps that we got, where it's something that Target only sells on their website. Yeah, this was shipped to someone and hopefully you can't, you viewers on YouTube can't see their address, but quite honestly it's like, I'll try not to show you your address. I'm not trying to dox no one. You can't just open the door behind you. <laughs> That's where the cat's tower is, so she wants to go in we there. We don't have a ghost, it's a cat. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh, okay, so we've got a little styrofoam on the top. And, ooh, it's not just a... The cool thing about these things is they are so well packed. It's a lamp. It's a lamp! I love they, lamp. they are so well packed like this. They are. So like you could ship this very easily. Yes, this is just a lamp. It looks like concrete. Feels like concrete. Interesting. Oh no. Oh no. I have two of these. I'm gonna clean this up and I'll get to another thing. <laughs> Ta-da! Lamps are fixed. Okay. Got another case packed item, as you can tell. This one was super gross. Uh, I don't know what it is, but it's still kind of wet. I think it's soap or lotion. It kind of smells like that. Um, this is a case bag. I looked in this uh, where we bought it because we wanted to make sure we even wanted to bother bringing it home because it was so gross looking. 
and turns out we did want to bring it home because it is four of these. Just uh, dry erase boards, metal framed, magnetic. So actually both I and my oldest daughter are wanting one of these each for our respective workspaces, school space, workspace. So I think we'll probably hold on to a couple of these and sell the other two and uh, this is a great find. So. Awesome. And we can go ahead and throw this box away. Just can. So I found those lamps. Okay, what, what's the deal with those lamps? They are quite ugly. Um, they are quite ugly. That's what she just said. 17 inch Jameson cement geo desk lamp gray by Decor Therapy. They are $32.49 each, which is a weird amount. $32.49. Not sold in stores. Not sold in stores. All right, so here we've got a woven basket. Uh, it is ripped. This is Pillow Fort, which is a Target brand. Um, I wouldn't, I would probably just say this is garbage, except it's full of stuff. It looks like it's full of clothing. A scrunchie and- It's a dress. A dress of some kind, another dress. I don't typically go through all the clothing too quick, but we make great money on clothing. So these are pleated pants, like, or pleated skirt. That's um like a uniform. French toast skirt. That's what that's I wonder called. if that's like a like here's the uniform. here's the school top half of the yeah, school, it's uniform. school uniform. Yeah, so that's that. I mean, this basket's probably trash. Um, the clothes we love clothes in that you make good money on them. We don't necessarily love clothes in that uh, they are kind of difficult to list and time consuming, but. It's good money, they sell, and you can sell them online. You can sell them on Poshmark, Mercari, Facebook Marketplace, locally, uh, eBay. So we, we do great on Kitizen. the clothes. Kitizen. Yeah. Another case packed item. Doesn't sound good. Don't know what this is. Oh, it is not case packed. I thought it was case packed. Oh, it's ready. Okay, we've got some. This is all uh, like health and beauty items. We've got um, from Wilds uh, hydrating hair and body mist. There's three bottles of that. Um, Moonray Bloom perfume, micro batch perfume. There's three things of that. And then um, here's another micro batch perfume. This one's Hawaiian Ruby Guava. There's one of those. And then finally, another par perfume, uh, Soli Notes. And all of these seem factory sealed, which is pretty awesome. Um, these are a bit damaged, but that's okay. But these perfumes, I and mean, we'll look them up. I mean, perfumes can be weirdly worth money, but I feel like those are probably just like preteen pre uh, front of Target perfumes. So let's see, I could probably do a couple more things before I clean up. I've got a mop. This is just a turtle wax. Oh, it's a car brush for washing your cars. It looks like maybe it's missing something here, or maybe that's just where you would put um, like a pressure washer. Can you put it on your hose? I think a pressure, like you need mm -hmm. the, the nozzle that like latches on. So like a pressure washer is probably what you need there. Um, it looks fine. So I'm going to say it's fine. I do have a pressure washer, so I can test this later. When it's warm, we are experiencing sub-zero temperatures for the next week. And I unloaded all this in a snowstorm and got very sweaty. So exciting stuff. All right. uh, we've got a doll stroller. This is, um, I mean, this is a yard sale item, let's be honest. It? it doesn't have any tags on it, but I mean, this is a few bucks at a yard sale. Then finally, oh, I don't need to open this one. This is a pedestal. Uh, 30, 34.75 inch pedestal. It's just a table to put like a lamp on or whatever. Tall skinny table. So that's that. I will clean all this up. Um, I really got to figure out how I'm going to organize this living room as I'm going through this stuff. And uh, I will get back to you with the next set of boxes. All right, back at it. One other big ticket item. We got a big jar of uh, Magnolia Home paint, Chip and Joanna. Um, we think it's gray. It's a, it, obviously it's a white base. Oh no, it's there. got the, that's see the paint spot? Right there? Yeah. No, that's not paint. That's like the oh. label get ripped off. I think, I don't know how to read it, but I think yeah. it might be gray. We think it's gray. We were looking at, if it's, um, 
if it's usable, it's something we'll use because it's definitely not something we can sell because uh, we don't know what color it is. We don't know what it'll look like when it dries, but we could use it around here. We've got like swing sets that need paint jobs and barns and just furniture and yeah, Bathroom. fun crafts <laughs> and whatnot. Yeah, maybe we'll just paint a whole room, a small room this color and just be happy with it. So no sweat there. I'm gonna bend down and get this. Okay. This is a classic mystery box. That's where all the fun happens. Yes. I think I need to sharpen this knife. It's fine. It's fine. All right. A little peek inside the box. We've got a comforter set there for now. We've got a pillow. We've got just some clothing. Got some fake eyelashes. We get fake eyelashes in every palette, I swear. It's and they're always like, like two bucks. Yeah. Like they're not worth anything. Yeah, we've got some uh, hair color. Very long. Yeah. Um, a paper towel holder. So I got makeup on it. So I'm imagining I'm gonna find some old makeup down here. Some like foundation or something. Okay, what's this? Uh, kids headphones. They're the ones with the, the like the governor on the volume control. Um, we've got one, not one, but two of these Infinity Pro by Conair uh, hair dryers, and they both look like they're brand new. We will, of course open those later and make sure that they are in fact brand new. So, those are uh, usually good for like 10 bucks. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> what is this, a quick watch palette? <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> That's garbage. Cat bed. And we got some clothing items. Again, clothing items are great. They do sell. We've got some kids' underwear. I don't know what size that is. Some more. These are size 10, I can tell you that. And then. Oh, I've got a mask, which is good. We keep these masks. We get so many of these Target masks, and they're fantastic because we don't have to spend any of our own money on masks, and uh, we can all be su safe and happy and healthy during the pandemic, and yada yada yada. But they're kind of crap in that, like, they are kind of just ruined after a couple washes, so you have to, uh, you know, replace often. Um, so the rest of this stuff just down here is just makeup. I don't want to really get too much into it because it's uh, some, like foundation powder and stuff that's just floating around in there. So that's that in the bottom of the bag. Makeup is hard to sell just because you don't know if it's used or not, and then if it is used, like it'd be gross. So it's we, sanitary, yeah. Yeah, it's not necessarily sanitary, exactly. So we will check into all those items individually, and then uh, some of them we will sell and others we will just throw away. So let me get to the next box. Next box, mystery box. We're in on it. I love these mystery boxes. They're almost always closed, but sometimes there's something fun. Mm -hmm. Okay, show you guys a little preview of what that is. Interesting box. Um, we've got no money. <laughs> little clutch. We've got a Oh, a squishy human body? Always with like the weird squishy stuff in these palettes. They, these are lungs. Yeah. Someone like really wanted to touch this in the store. <laughs> like, I need to know. <laughs> what does kidneys feel like? Just put that there. Uh, oh, this is an open bottle of uh, pure Castile soap. Hemp tea. Oh, it's like bust. That's it's busted in a funny way, like the the little. Probably still got a seal on it. Yeah. Thankfully. Yeah, it does. I can't smell it. It's, that it's, stuff is like super versatile. Yeah. So I mean, we'll probably keep this just because the the caps busted the way it is. But awesome hip soap. Put cardboard on me. Little man cave. We don't have any little men in our house. Yeah, no, yeah. We're we're a house of ladies and one one. One fully grown man. Some mountains. I kind of like that. What if it's a 
Uh, I would guess it's a set, except yeah. this one's also the exact same. Yeah, so what it is, so is the little not. man cave goes in the middle. Uh, I don't know that. Oh, yeah, 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 like this, because they're, they're opposites. Yeah, and then... Gotcha. Yeah. That's my guess. Cool. That'll probably be a local sale for us, and I bet it will sell. I actually know somebody... Who has who a little man. ...is a regular buyer that is about to have a little man. Here's some uh, sweat pants. No motion. We've got... Um, what is this uh, for putting makeup on, right? It's a beauty blender. Beauty blender. Got some other makeup items. Ooh, this isn't. What is this? Oh, these are um, little LED lights. Uh, uh, dew drop lights. Warm white twinkling. Some various makeups. Here is a weirdly perfect lampshade. Which is awesome because usually lampshades are trash. We get the lamp and the shade is trash. Yeah, so we probably have a lamp that needs a shade, so we might throw it on there if it looks all right, but that is a, a large rectangle. Well, sometimes you can sell them anyways because people will Want them. have lamps and not like the shade. Yeah, so this is just a blanket set that is doesn't have the original price on it. So just a throw. Another piece of makeup and a pair of warm fuzzy socks. So we'll get used this week. Which will get used this week, most likely. So I'm gonna put all this up and then we'll get on to the next box. All right, so this box has been opened before. Uh, so I'm gonna open it just out of curiosity, but it says it's some kind of seed. So we will see, but it was shipped to someone and they returned it. So let's see what it is. It is some kind of seat. These are just uh, like cushions for a patio chair of some kind. So, oh. awesome. Just two of those mirror images. Explains why it's so light. Yes. Someone either bought too many or didn't like the color or something. Next thing, let's, let's, do, let's do this. And then we'll do that. Get through a couple of the bigger ticket items. Lamp set from Threshold. It's a two lamp, an up lamp, and a down lamp. Up light and a down light, I guess is the right way to say that. Those are pretty good. I don't know how much that'll go for, but those usually run like, I don't know, 50 bucks in the store. So probably $25 bill for us uh, if someone wants it. This is a good item. You, you looked this item up already. What, how much did this go for? It's potentially a good item. Potentially. $139.99. $139.99, but clearly it's been opened and put back in the box. Uh, so we will obviously tear into this off camera and uh, check and see if all the items are in there. I don't know if Do they will be. Do you want to tell the people what it is? It is an hour generation. Oh, I guess you can't see on the front because there's nothing there. It's an hour generation, like, schoolhouse set. So I just, when you turned it, there's literally a Target bag inside there. Yes, I saw the Target yeah. bag, yeah. So that's probably all the accessories and stuff. Um, hopefully someone just didn't like it and returned it and everything's there. Uh, if not, maybe we can piece enough of it together to sell something in, like, a sale. Yard or otherwise, um, we might... Uh, youngest daughter has one of these dolls and maybe it becomes part of her playset. But she also has Barbies and also Legos and a million other things, so it's not like we need more of this stuff in our house. <laughs> so, I'm gonna put this here. And let's dive into another mystery box. Let's do this one. I'm enjoying the mystery. away from yourself. Safety first. And not too deep into the box. Not too deep into the box. <laughs> okay. A little peek at this. Um, we've got some oven mitts, which we actually kept an oven mitt off the last pallet. So, got some more clothing items. I know oh, these are... Kitchen towel. No, they're curtains. Oh. There you go. Okay, cute actually. Yeah. Um, Body Envy Volumizing Hairspray. Oh, we're keeping this. We're also keeping the hairspray. It's a, it's a wireless charger for um, a micro, or is that mini? It's micro, micro USB. But what's especially good on here is there's a one amp uh, wall outlet with a USB port. And we were just talking on the drive to this place how my daughter's is failing and she needs a new one. So, awesome. Our middle kid's name starts with an H. Yeah. Doesn't match any of our other ones, but stocking, 
We've got some uh, clothes, swimwear for oh, all the uh, all our, a, and a mask. That's a leotard. Our, oh, that's a leotard. That's for like tumbling ballet oh, and stuff like that. Yeah. Okay. The shorts are too. I don't know what this is. I'm guessing it's a sheet or a hoodie. Oh, some kind of clothing item. <laughs> a sheet or a hoodie. A sheet or a hoodie. There's it some underwear and stuff there. Fabric. More <laughs> underwear. A unicorn stocking. That's cute. That looks like a sheep with a, <laughs> with a horn. <laughs> uh, okay, so uh, a week ago, last weekend, uh, we finally had to give up our, our sheet. We were hoping to find sheets on a pallet and uh, because our sheets were just wearing out and finally like I must dream like I'm running in my sleep or something and I tore a hole uh, where my feet go on our sheets and uh, you know within like a couple days like the hole was the length of the sheets and so my wife went to Target and bought sheets and you spent about 20 bucks there about 20 ones, bucks yeah. they're the cheap ones still but like we, they would be free if we found them on a pallet so if these are size queen oh it's a bed skirt ah <laughs> I don't have to feel bad yet. <laughs> a lot of pallet to go. What is this? It looks empty. It's an empty tech deck, uh, which I, I believe was like uh, like the mini uh, finger skateboards and stuff, um, but clearly was stolen by finger discount, so we just got the packaging. Uh, Ten shirts. We've got another Christmas uh, pet sweater. That's enough to be Christmas. It doesn't have to, but it is Christmas. Yeah. Um, and then. We've got uh, bed risers. Uh, my youngest brother is going to college. I'll probably just ask him if he wants these. And then uh, he's going to college next fall. Very proud of him. Way to go, Jordan. And uh, yeah, I'll pack up this box. And we'll move on to the next side. Another big mystery box. Just keep this one on the floor and I'll put the stuff on the table. Okay, this one will be quick. It seems to be just a few large items. We've got... Oh, this is one of those uh, wedge pillows. High density foam. It's just all wrapped up tight. And uh, yeah. Alright, next item. Resumed. <laughs> this is a... Uh, please use no... Looks. I, I would assume this is a rug. It is a rug. Okay, there's the there's, 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 there's rug right there. This is just garbage. Rugs are great. Rugs sell well. So we're happy to get rugs. Oh, 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 oh. oh my goodness, there's two of them. Oh, I'm very concerned about this. It's the ice horse from Frozen with an Elsa. Would somehow go in there, and uh, like I said, there's two of them, and Super weird. two Elsas. So, um, does that horse move? Uh, yeah, yes, and somehow you would get Elsa. Get in there, Elsa. <laughs> How are children supposed to do this? I don't know. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> These might end up being my kids. <laughs> they're cool. I don't know if uh, how they how they're really supposed to work, but. Also, just weird that they're cool. I'm not in any packaging. Oh, I can tell you exactly what happened here. Two sisters got them, and they didn't like them, or they kept falling over, and uh, parents are like, "We're returning that." And that's what we got too. But they're in great condition, so we'll either sell them as used or keep them. We've got a ladle for all your uh, punch bowls. We've got some clothing items and some like towels. It's a baby towel. What is this? A rather large blanket. A quilt, rather. A quilt. Some more clothing and uh, one sock. I'm only pulling this out to make sure there's nothing under it, but some free packing materials for shipping. 
and that's it. That's the bottom of the box. So I will pack all this back up, and we'll move on to the next one. All right, we'll do a couple big together. All right, here we have a rather large table. I did look at, I'm knocking my doors here. Um, I did look it up in the store, or uh, yeah, where we bought this, and it is a wood top table, so that's good. It's probably all there. I will pull this out of the box later and make sure it's good. Do you remember what this costs? Oh, that's 180 $180 table. So that's awesome. And like I said, it's all wood, so it's probably fine. Yeah, it's like a coffee table. And then we've got two of these. And how much were these? I don't know what that is. Oh, were these? I thought these were the so ones you were... they are, um, what's it called? Bedside oh, tables. They're bedside tables, yeah. as you can see by those. Well, we don't know which one they are. Yeah, we can't figure out like which design they are, and the they, the price ranges on Target's website were pretty wild, right? They went from like yeah, like eighty bucks to three hundred bucks maybe. And we have two of these, so we will pull it open, find out exactly what the design is, and then get a price together. Maybe I'll put that here if I haven't done that yet. I don't know. We'll find out. So, like I said, we got two of these. These are heavy. Okay, we've got a tension caddy for a shower. Um, it's box damage there, so I'll pull all this out, make sure it's fine. Uh, you know, these things are really, stuff like this has been really hit and miss for us here lately, uh, or just all around. Um, you know, sometimes we sell something like this in a few minutes within listing it, and otherwise it could take a little while. Um, but it'll probably all sell in a in-person sale. And I'll just, we'll rock one. My battery's about to die, but I think I can get through one more little mystery box before I get to it. And we are not even halfway through all the stuff. So we're closing in on halfway, but we're not there yet. Right, there's a preview. What's to come? We've got some construction paper, some shirts and underwear. This stuff is good. You know, I know it's not exciting on these videos, but there's a lot of money in this stuff. So happy to get it. Boxer briefs size medium to other oh, boys Boo. Actually, I think all of this is like youth kind of underwear in here and that's all that is youth underwear and socks so I will clean this up and then we've got a bunch of mystery boxes over there I mean touch the side on this uh, this stuff on this side of the room there's slightly more stuff on this side of the room than there is on this side of the room so we will get back to you in a few minutes moments for you seconds for you even Okay, we've got nothing but mystery items over there. So I think what I'll start doing is I'll pull one for sure item over here and then I'll open a mystery box. So we've got these rugs. There's two of them taped together. We were poking around in these when we brought them in. And uh, what's weird is these, I think maybe they were drop shipped by Target because they've got like a shipping label from Walmart dot com slash jet dot com and then a shipping label from target so i'm a little curious if maybe they were drop shipped by target maybe is target doing that i don't know um like i said two rugs they're probably runners of some kind it's hard to say uh is that two great shaggy okay big mystery box bottom's coming out of it bottom's coming out of it i'm gonna put it on the ground maybe put right here Yep, that's exactly what that is. Another wedge pillow. Neither one has a barcode. Yeah, that is weird. Mm -hmm. Alright, um, some undies, some stockings. We're still getting Christmas stuff. Do those have letters on them? No, they're just bare. Um, pajama set, Christmas pajama set. We've got a thermometer, in ear baby thermometer. Oh, recommended for infants, children, and adults. So, we'll test that and see if it's all good. We've oh got a doll. God, it's one of those creepy dolls. Um, 
I felt something wet, so I'm wondering if it's one of those. It's one of the ones that like pees and stuff, probably. Yeah. Not feeling up the baby. Let me see what's going on. No, that's just a battery pack. It's definitely not waterproof, so I hope nobody's putting water in this thing. There must have been something else wet. But it's a creepy baby doll whose eyes are few shut. Open your eyes, baby. Somebody messed up that doll. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the joints are wet. I think someone took it in the bathtub. That's my guess. I ruined it. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Uh, and then what do you do? What you is... take it back to the store. Right, yeah. yeah. Uh, a Midsummer, uh, Midsummer, however that movie was called. Uh, wreath. We've got. Uh, it's a sheet set. Definitely a return. Uh, there's a fitted uh, top sheet in there. That pattern. We've got the rest of that underwear. Curtain set. More under rear. Another curtain. Oh, good. It no. helps. It helps when you have more than one. Another so. curtain. So we've got three of those at least. Just gonna dig around a little bit. We've got a rug. It's mm. kind of a nice one. Mm. We've got a quilt. That's a. That's, that's an outfit. Clothing. Yeah. That is a. That is a hoodie that looks like a quilt. Neat. For like the hip old lady. We've got another quilt. That one is a quilt. And then just some garbage. So that's all that it's in that one. A bunch of soft goods. So we will uh, be right back. Okay, let's see. Next uh, big item. This. We've got an over the door duck hunting game. It has been open, so we will open it and make sure everything is there. It's pretty cool. Maybe we'll play it a little bit just to make sure it works. And uh, yeah, that's that. <laughs> These boxes. Um, you watched my last videos, even though they are hard to hear because I didn't record audio like a dummy, but can confirm I'm recording it right now. At least I hope so. Um, we got a bunch of these boxes and they were all full of the front of Target, like bullseye dollar items. Then we had five boxes and we got thousands of items out of them. And uh, although we will be able to sell that and recoup a bunch of money, plus we'll donate all that hand sanitizer we got if we haven't already by the time you're watching this video. Uh, we haven't at the time of recording this video. We're working on it and uh, you know, so our money will get recouped. It's just that one's gonna take a long time. Here's a little preview of this box. It's like some fun mystery items. We've got some curtains. We've got a bath rug. And another bath rug, exactly the same. And another one, someone was doing their whole house. This is a, it's like a towel bar, I guess, or a over the duck door hook rail. That's probably a sale item. Oh, here's, oh, here it is. It's that lizard from Frozen 2. So, yeah, that'll be a probably easy flip for us. Flip if I keep breaking stuff. <laughs> uh, we've got a phone case for new iPhone 5.4 inches. I like how they don't say what iPhone it is. It's the new one. Thanks. It has been open, but it looks fine. Uh, makeup. What is this? Oh, oh, I'll get to that in a second. Um, towel, towel. A bottom. What is this? Do these things go together? They look like they go together, but maybe, oh. Is that on the bottom? This is a coffee grinder? It's a milk frother. I'm not bougie enough. I was going to say, it's, for like, like, it's a, missing a top if it's a... Yeah. Well, it might be most missing a top even if it's a milk frother. I don't know. Do you just froth your milk with no top? I don't know if you do it topless or not. <laughs> we'll sounds look like, in. Sounds like a personal preference. We'll look into this. Okay, so the item that's over here is another weighted blanket. So the first weighted blanket we had sold like immediately. And then the second weighted blanket we had, we got, we still have. So I don't know. 
Um, it's a 20 pound weighted blanket. Yeah. And uh, it looks like pretty well used. So we will see. And then milk frother. We can see if that frosts. So that's that, that's that mystery box. And uh, we will get another one after we clean this up.